Hi, I'm Hannah Pivacek and I've been a collector with the Preferred Group of Tampa for a little over a year now. As a collector, I try and remain positive throughout the whole phone call and give the debtor all of their options to resolve the balance as soon as the debtor advises that they're not able to pay in full. This allows the debtor to feel like they're in control of the situation and they're not being backed into a corner and during an already stressful situation. My name is Bailey Woolard. I've been with DRS since this past April. Um, I would say that my biggest collector tip in the year of 2022 would be learning the art of understanding and listening to a consumer. Um, and in regards to that, it, this the world that we live in right now, everybody's going through something either mentally, physically, or financially. Um, and it just takes that one person to listen to somebody and understand somebody um, in regards to that. And that helps ease the customer, consumer, and that helps get a payment and build rapport. Um, it doesn't always have to be a big payment. It can be a payment that works best for them, knowing their situation, just understanding the consumer itself is a big key in collections, in my opinion. Hi, I'm Hannah Campbell. I've been with DRS of Ohio since this past April, so I'm a newbie. And my best tip for 2022 is to ask questions. Being so new to the industry, I rely on my coworkers, so I ask them questions. And I want to do my job well, so I ask questions. And I also ask the consumers the questions that I need answers to in order to find the right payment solution for them. So that is my best tip. Be inquisitive, don't be shy, and ask questions. Hi, I'm Cole. Um, I've been a collector with the Preferred Group of Tampa for about three years now. Um, my best technique is to communicate effectively. I've found that if you use positive words um, and not really use too many negative words, if I can't or I'm unable to, um, and actually tell the debtor what you're able to do, um, you're building that rapport with them and the trust, and then therefore they are able to work with you a little bit better and you do have effective communication lines open. Hi, I'm Erin Swartz. I've been a collector at the Preferred Group of Tampa roughly six years now. I find that one of my best collector techniques is becoming the debtor's ally by making the debtor believe that I'm here to help rather than talking about putting things on their credit. They tend to open up about their situation a little bit more, which allows me to find a solution that will work best for them to get their debt resolved and stay within guidelines for my company. Hi, my name is Marta Mangesha, and I've been working with the Preferred Group of Tampa for about five years. One of my best collector techniques is keeping an open line of communication. So a lot of my debtors are current payers or, you know, new payers, and keeping communication via email or by calling them or sending a letter. And the reason for doing that is to potentially receive payment in full if they're already paying or if they weren't able to pay today by keeping an open communication they may be able to pay you two or three months down the line. In an industry that can be very negative, it is important to stay positive and have good energy. Good energy is everything. Your consumer can hear your, your energy in your voice. So try to stay positive, um, try to stay upbeat and have good vibes when speaking with your consumer. It will make a lot of difference in your call.